I'm Maria Phelps, and I am one of the owners here at Black Diamond Mortgage, and I want to share with you my home ownership story. Back in 2007, I bought my first home with my husband, and interestingly enough, we were actually living with my parents at the time, and if I could go back, I would have not bought a house in 2007. We were new parents, we didn't have a lot of money, and we decided to jump into home ownership because I felt like... I had to do it. Well, fast forward, 2008 hits, and we didn't, we actually didn't really have a lot of money. We really couldn't afford the house. And as you know, 2008 was a very interesting year, and housing prices went down, but also people who really couldn't afford to get homes were getting into mortgages before that, and that was part of the housing crisis. So we really couldn't afford our mortgage. I was actually taking out my max student loan amount in order to pay our mortgage. And I look back again and I'm like, why the heck did I do that? But I honestly didn't know. I didn't know what my options were. I didn't, I didn't know that that was a really stupid thing to do. So then in 2000, late in 2009, or excuse me, in 2008, we were able to actually sell our house. We got an opportunity to purchase a house from my parents, actually. We had a, a great opportunity. It was a good price, and um, it was on state lease land, so it was uh, an opportunity for us to own something and have the payment not be so high, so it was kind of a fresh start. But before that, we were in a position where we had actually uh, filed for bankruptcy, and a lot of that had to do with not so much our house purchase, but uh, I had some medical things happen, and uh, we had a lot of medical bills, and so we had to file for bankruptcy. So getting into a position where we could sell our house and get into a lower payment was great. We needed a fresh start. So we purchased that home from my parents. We sold the house, and uh, we only lost like $5,000, which is actually not too bad in 2008. So then we, we buy this house for my parents and a great opportunity. We lived right next to them, but it ended up really being a money pit. We thought we were saving money and uh, overall we did, but we still had to put a lot of work into that home. Then uh, we lived there. I homeschooled my kids there. I started my own marketing company there. It was a great house for us to kind of get a fresh start. All the while, though, if you don't know, uh, bankruptcy is something that it actually it can give you a fresh start. But what happens is it, it allows creditors, like they want you at that point. They know you don't have any debt. So we were able to finance vehicles, RVs, boats. I mean, we did everything that a lot of people do now. And I look back and it's like, man, I wish I would have known then what I know now. So had a lot of financed things, and we had this home that was kind of a, a money pit, uh, and I had my own business. My husband has a great, had a great job, and uh, we thought we were kind of doing okay, and I had actually reached out to Dave at Black Diamond in 2015 to see about buying another home. I, I knew I didn't want to live in that house anymore. It, it was something, you know, I wanted a, a dream house. I wanted something a little better, and uh, I had that conversation with him, and my, my price that I wanted was way up here, and he said, oh, you need to come down here. <laughs> so a little bit of a reality check of how much damage I had done with our debt to income and uh, maxing out all my student loans, having over 80000 in student loans, because like I said, I used some of those student loans funds to you know, graduate, but also to pay my mortgage. So uh, the cool thing was he was able to get us into a home, and it was a little dramatic, actually. Uh, we, in January of 2015, I, I was talking to Dave about buying another house, but we knew that it wasn't going to happen right away because we didn't have a down payment. We had a few things we had to fix with our credit. Uh, however, the gentleman's house next to us actually burned down, and uh, we woke up that morning, it was like three in the morning, flames. I mean, you could feel the heat coming over into our home. And the gentleman actually passed away uh, in, in that home. And uh, just witnessing that and uh, seeing the flames and knowing that he was inside was pretty traumatic for my family and I. And um, it wasn't until later that day that we knew that he had died in it. But um, 
anyway, <laughs> I wasn't going to get emotional with this, but uh, he, he had passed away and it was traumatic. Uh, imagine walking out of your home and just smelling electric wires. And I called Dave right away and I said, I, I have to buy a house. I cannot live here anymore. I don't care what we have to do. And he sat us down. He said, okay, this is what you need to do. Uh, we literally got under contract right away and I had to save up my down payment. And I tell you what, if you don't think you can save up, you know, a down payment uh, when, when things are at you and you're, you're trying to figure out solutions, like it can happen. And, and I hear it all the time when people say, I can't save up 3%, I can't save up 5%. It's amazing what you can do when you really put your mind to it. And we did, we were able to get everything we needed and uh, we were able to purchase that home. And what's great about that, that was in March of 2015, is by that summer, I was actually working at Black Diamond Mortgage. So um, it's pretty cool. I think the experience that I had and actually the learning, you know, through the process of that purchase, I was able to learn, you know, some of the things I did wrong. You know, I, I couldn't help, you know, going to the emergency room and spending three days in the hospital you know, for the medical bills, I couldn't help that. Um, but the thing, the choices that I made after that, you know, I learned a lot from it. And so coming into Black Diamond and uh, talking with Dave and just really learning, you know, the, the right path to home ownership, uh, it was really good for me. And now, I mean, that was 2015 I'm, and we have, our lives have changed so much. So that purchase allowed me to pay off all of our debt, paid off all my student loans, and uh, I actually have money in savings now, which is completely opposite of what I was like in 2007, 2008, on up to 2015. Totally different. So uh, home ownership to me has literally been a life changer. And uh, I, I recommend it to everyone. It, it is sometimes hard at first. You have to make a lot of sacrifices. When we bought that house in 2015, it was a big step up. 2007, our house was 140,000, and I went from 140,000 to 275. Like that was a big deal, and the payment was way different. But there was a mindset shift, and uh, just learning that and realizing that you know I was purchasing the biggest asset that could really help me for future financial freedom, and uh, just also now seeing that in other people is amazing. So uh, home ownership is. A blessing to me and uh, I would love you know I I would love to share that with anybody out there it, it's been a blessing for my family thank you